provocateur trying to get somebody to agree to violence or what, he's, what, what was that all about? Unfortunately, uh, a gentleman very early on walked up to me and tried to buddy up to me and uh, out of his mouth nice. He said, well, I just wish the whole place would blow up if you know what I mean. Huh. And I said, no, no violence. Yeah. Sir. We're not looking for violence here. And uh, he disappeared five minutes oh. later. He has not been seen since. Older gentleman. Uh, green shirt, uh, shorts, rather arrogant, by the way. And, and of course, he was hoping that you would agree, and then they would arrest you. That would be grounds for be arrest for conspiracy <laughs> uh, to commit terrorism. Well, you know, I've been on uh, quite a few radio shows and uh, web programs over the past few weeks, and I have reiterated time and time again, I am here to cover the event as a journalist, as a documentary filmmaker, and in no way, shape, or form do I advocate any violence against anybody in there. Correct. I don't think, I think that's the, that's, that's the case for, I would say, everyone here except for an insane person or a government paid provocateur who's here to just cause trouble. Absolutely. And that's the, that's the bottom line, Mark. And, you know, we're here to get the truth out when the mainstream media refuses to recover it or uh, cover it. You know, I've already talked to RT America, uh, German television. I just talked to at, at length. Uh, the gentleman was rather interested in uh, what I had to say and has actually given me his card and really an open invitation to uh, to give him a call uh, with more information. So that's a that's a great sign. It sees we, it says we are breaking barriers, yep. not only in the media here but the international media as well, which this does pertain to them, yes. as this is the Anglo-American power structure yep. out of Europe. And, you know, you're going to see the Davignons of the world here. You're going to see European banksters here. You're going to see a consolidation of power, not only in the United States and in the Eurozone, but beyond. So it really does affect the world. Yep. Awesome, brother. Right, Good to see you, man. Good to see you, too. Had that provocateur thing happen to me so many times throughout the years. I have no idea.